Okay, I'm going to do this all over again, this video, because, you know, I had, I guess when I was talking, I was going on one subject and jumping to one thing and not finishing, so I didn't want to make it to where y'all didn't understand what I was talking about, but let me tell you, this is just, I uh, was just, got off the phone with some kind of agency, it's called Exploring Talent, you know, you know how I was talking about one thing I would do to get a reality show is by getting on other, getting parts on movies, um, auditions, you know, auditioning for stuff, and either either that or getting on other reality shows just to get myself out there because I don't, because I, because I know if I just, let's say if I really want this reality show to work and want it's the reality show to make it. You know, I got to get myself out there first, you know. I can't just put a reality show on here and people be watching. They be like, okay, I've never heard of this person. I don't know this person, you know. You ain't therefore ain't going to get a lot of people watching. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you get a lot of people watching it. And so, but so basically, what I've been doing, I've been going online looking for auditioning, any kind of opportunities to act or do anything like that. And one place I, there was a website, it's called Exploring Talent. And what they do is they recruit, they, they basically are like a recruiting agency. It basically, you've got people, casting directors and stuff, looking for people to act, looking for extras. Um, you, you get all sorts of things. And uh, I know they had an auditioning opportunity here in Louisville for me to do a part. I forget what it is. Now you got a part somewhere something going on in Atlanta that I could do. And then, um, and then they had a game contestant. They said there's they need contestants for a game show. Now, they said it's a new game show. I don't know if it's already filming, because if it just started filming, and they're looking for contestants, I know whose it is, you know. The guy, the guy that said the, the casting director looked at that, and I don't know. I might know who it is, but I don't know. I ain't gonna say it is. Because it's probably not. But... <laughs> But you know what? If it's Snoop Dogg looking for somebody to be on his Snoop Dogg's Wild Show, you know, I think I'll do that. That'd be a good place to start. Shoot. <laughs> and, uh, but anywho, I'm not saying that's what it is because we don't know until we see it, right? You know, I'm not, but to sit there, but I'm going to tell you about this. They called me. I called Exploring Back, and they were just telling me about those opportunities that I had just mentioned. And they told me that they have to activate my profile so these casting directors can see it and can contact me and do all that good stuff. But in order to, to activate it, I got to pay for a membership fee. And they said the membership fee was like $280 for two years. Um, it's ninety by hundred dollars for well they said for for seventy dollars or something for three months. You know, if I paid that or it's thirty dollars a month. So now me when I got people okay, when I got places asking me to send them money, I'm gonna get kinda leery. You know, I know agencies I mean you have to pay agencies to get recognized I mean it's something I, I I don't understand see I'm kind of I will admit that I got the skill but I don't know a lot about the business and you know it's it's like when you got I mean do agencies that are looking for people recruiting people do they actually ask you to pay them something because I thought those in the uh, show or movie whoever don't they I thought the casting directors paid for that. 
You know, I get kind of leery when they ask him for money like that. So, you know, what I'm going to have to do is um, I do have a question. Does anybody know anything about it's called Exploring Talent. I forget what it's, it's a website. But does anybody know anything about it? And if they do, are they legit? Or do I need to not even have, not touch them? You know, I do need, that's where I pretty much need help, need guidance right now. Where do I go look for these opportunities? Because, I mean, when you got somebody asked to send you money, I'm going to be kind of leery about it. He said, well, we're with, we are got Triple B, whatever. Well, I'll just call the Better Business Bureau to, to check and find out. If they're a legit company, if they're ripping you off, all this shit, you know? I mean, if there's somebody to actually use the site, I mean, did they get, I mean, did they get what, the, what they paid for or what? Because I know that it isn't free to do all this stuff. I know you got to pay money to go out here and get these opportunities to act and do my reality shows and I mean, it's just like the music industry. You probably don't have to pay as much, so at least I ain't have to, I mean, shit, getting, going and paying an agent or something like that is cheaper than buying, than, than going, get studio time. Shit. Turk was on here the other day talking about how much money you got to spend to, to get studio time and all that shit. I'm telling you what, I know exactly what he was talking about. That's why I didn't want to. I wasn't really worried about getting a record deal when I was doing the rap things for a while. That's why I just wanted to get an indie label, go do it myself, get my own shit. You know, I was, you know, doing shit like that. But now, just to prove the point, now let me tell you, I was in that group today, Bridge Haven. And that guy just sat here and act like I, I thought this stuff was going to come true. And that there's some magic, it's some kind of magical thing that's going to happen. And I'm just going to be rich. I'm going to be big. I'm going to be rich and famous and shit like that. You know, I wasn't thinking like that. Because, you know, you think I don't know nothing. You think They think I don't know shit. But I guess, you know, when you work at a mental health place, I guess... You, cause yeah, you're gonna get people who do think like that and think everything is true, and you know. And let's just give this use this exploring talent as an example, okay? Let's just say one of those people got this call. You know what they would probably have done? They probably would have went ahead and paid him some money, thinking that you know without even checking. You know what I'm saying? They would have done something like that. Because they would have believed everything that was told. You know? Me, I'm the kind of person that, honestly, anybody could tell me something. But I'm not going to really believe you. I'm not going to really believe nothing until I see it. So, I'm this kind of this kind of person, well, I never know. You never know if this, she's telling the truth. Never know if somebody's telling me this and that. You know? I never know about this exploring talent agency you know, they could be true. But then again, you might have to watch them. And like I said, I'm one of them people who want to see shit before I believe what, what's being said. You know, and that's the case with this, uh, you know, exploring talent. You know, I'm going to see if this company is legit. But just for that, uh, just to be told in group that, you know, just to be told some discouraging word. I mean, the guy was just rather discouraging, you know? And, you know, it's very common for some of these workers at Bridge Haven to do that, you know? There was times when I was going for regular dreams. You know, I wanted to be a, a, what did I wanted to do? I wanted to actually go back to school and take something. No, nah, they discouraged me, tell me, it's you're not really stable enough to go back to school. You don't need to go back to school. Oh, no, you don't need to work at job. It's overstimulating. I said, no, you don't need to work here. You need to come up here. You need to be up here every day. You don't need to work. What do you mean I don't need to work? You know, just shit like that. Hmm. 
you know, just told me shit. But if I was that stupid, thinking this was all going to happen, I mean, I would have, like I said, been stupid and, and, and got the $30 because, you know, I don't even barely have the much money now. But I got the $30, but I need it for other things till the end of the month. But as much as the guy on the phone was pressuring me, telling me this and that, that you have to do this today, you know, I would have been dumb and probably went and got a card and paid it already. But, you know, I'm not just going to go just step out on something like that. I'm going to do some research. You know, I just told the guy, just call me back tomorrow. Just call me back tomorrow because, you know, I told him I didn't have the money at all. So I, I just did whatever I could to get him off the phone. Okay. You got extra blanket. Um, uh, that blue one. Right yeah. there. Get that blue one right there. That blue one ain't no good. Well, I don't know what to use. What about this one? Okay, use that one. No, but I think that's a good, I think that's what I need to do. I need to find out if, if exploring talent, I'll get the name of the website or wherever it was. If anybody does know anything about them, or if you could really offer me some advice on this, please let me know. I really appreciate it, and I would love you forever. But anywho, I got another subject to discuss on this. And, you know, I was just sitting here talking about, like I was sitting here talking about, you know. I'm not stupid. I mean, this guy's going to sit here and think I'm stupid and just think I'm a little kid and just say, oh, wow, 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 yay, yay, yay. You know what? Because chances are, you ain't guaranteed. It is no guarantee you're going to get it. It's just like going for a regular job somewhere. You know, you ain't guaranteed to get that job. You know, it's much stupid. And especially, you go into stuff like the film and the music industry, and you blow up and become big and famous. How many people you think are going for that one part, you know? Like, say, you know, ain't going to be... Like people trying to be Brad Pitt, Lil Wayne, whoever. You know what I'm saying? It's just like I was talking about American Idol. You've got so many people going for a dream. And you may have somebody that was really good but never got it. And it might not have been because they wasn't just good enough. It's just you never know what kind of judges you're going to get. You never know who you're going to be. But yes, you are. See? You're going to get some retarded-ass judges. I don't like American Idol myself, you know. Yeah, but like still, it. you don't know who's going to listen to your part, what they're going to think. You know what I'm saying? It's one of the things that's beyond your control. But, you know, I ain't going to let somebody work up their bridge. I even just tell me to give up. Because right. that's what they do. That's what they do. All they want us to do is come up here to Bridge Haven and come home and sit in our apartments all damn day and not do shit. I mean, they didn't want. They didn't, like I said. There's times I wanted to work when I worked part time job. But, well, I don't have really much left. We'll go get some more later. Well, yeah, you're gonna have to because people like we're going through and we got we gotta slow down on this. I'll get you some more later. You know, I would like to see if this company's legit because if it is, like I said, there's probably I've got other people here. Yeah, be on my show. Want to get in. Probably want to get in on this too. You know, like I said, people that live in my house, those are the people. Yeah, people that are here all the time, definitely gonna be on there on, on my show when it happens. You know, yeah, I talk about my show like it's gonna happen, but I just it's not that. And I talk about it because I like it. I have fun. I have fun doing what I do. You know, I enjoy this. I enjoy I enjoy being on TV show. I enjoy acting. I enjoy music. I enjoy writing writing rap songs. I enjoy doing that. It's fun to do. Is there something wrong with that? You know, I do these projects. I always get these little projects going, but there's nothing wrong with that. It keeps me going. Shit, it really makes me mad. But anywho, I'm getting on the next subject here. And I'm going to start another video since it'll be a totally different subject. I'm going to talk about snitches, okay? Well, we're going to do that on my next video. Stay tuned, and I will see you in a minute.